And now we get a peek at some of the top players here for this Madden Ultimate Team matchup. Brandon God and Charles Davis ready to go in the booth. We hope you're ready to go at the controls. Let's play. Here's the kicker, Harrison Butker, ready to get this one started. And we are underway from Kansas City. Taken at the 15, a short kick. first down run as they get this forward for about six yards a quick burst there and he nicely bit off a pretty decent game six yards on that last play here's second and four Camara out of the pistol and takes this one across the 35 to the 36, a gain of about four. Pretty good job defensively. Thought he was going to get it, but they knew where that marker was and they stopped him just short of it. What it does is emphasize that strategic football and situational football is not just played on the offensive side, is it? Defense understanding, as you noted, where the first down marker was and making sure they didn't get there. An early test for this defense. Here we go on third and inches. They fake the give. Now Mahomes. He's got the first down and more past midfield. And he'll get this down to the 39-yard line. How about 25 yards on third down? They'll take it. So now first and 10 in Chiefs territory at the 39-yard line. Here's Kamara. And he'll get four here down to the 35-yard line. Well, in every play call, you realize it's not going to go for a touchdown. So a lot of your calls are setting things up for maybe later in the game, trying to establish the inside run, run with toughness now, hopefully get to the perimeter later. And let's face it, you could do worse than a four-yard run on first down. They go play fake. Mahomes. All right, rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. Picked up by the Hall of Famer, Junior Seau. And they will finally get him as he's all the way down near the 40-yard line. That right there is the inauspicious start that they were hoping to avoid the turnover on the first possession. I love how you use those college-bound words like that, inauspicious. Well done. I really appreciate that. Thank you. But here's the thing for me. I'm just wondering if their game plan is incorrect. You know, I think they felt like they could come in and throw it around pretty well. That interception early, they may rethink how they go about attacking. His favorite target, Travis Kelsey, the intended receiver. But it'll be second down. On the ground, this is Saquon Barkley. And he works it past the 30, almost to the 25. That goes for a Chiefs first down, 14 yards. 
That O line, they cleared a big hole there on that run. The athleticism of offensive lines continues to evolve, and we're seeing it here. Not only they control things right at the line of scrimmage, but they're able to get upfield to get to what we call the second and the third levels. You know, get to linebacker spot, the secondary spot, getting all the way downfield with their blocking, which helps keep the running back clean. They'll try to continue that trend here this afternoon. Looking for the end zone, and this is going to be intercepted. Picked off by Marshawn Lattimore. Oh, timing is everything on a route like this. He tried to drive that football into a tight spot. And if you're a little early or a little late, chances are there's going to be someone there. And sure enough, this one's going the other way. The Saints offense on the field ready to get their drive started. Now, they were intercepted the first time they had the football, but now they get it back and it's still 0-0. And because of that, you know what the thought process is? Interception. What interception? It didn't really happen because they gave up no points. So go back on the attack. Go back and run the offense you believe will be successful. Find your playmakers and give them the football. And he's going to get this one across the 30-yard line. Give him 13 yards on the opening play of the drive and also give him a first down. Here's Mahomes to throw. And break, the tight end's got it. And past the 40 before he's out of bounds. 10 yards, good for his Saints first down. Now Mahomes. And the play goes nowhere. Losing yardage back near the 40 at the 39. So it goes as a completed pass, but they lose a full five yards. No score after one on EA Sports. Still 15 yards to go, second down. They go play action, now Mahomes. Escaping the pressure right. And he's left with no option here but to throw it away. Defensively, Charles, they continue to really limit this offense as far as yardage goes. Yeah, you're exactly right. They've been assignment sound, staying in their lanes, keeping proper leverage, and communicating well, too. An incomplete pass on that last play, and that means they'll need to come up with something here on third down. Mahomes going to throw. And the catch made, it's Tyler Boyd. And he is going to have a Saints first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Mahomes now on first down. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. And he is tackled inside the 40, not quite to the 35. And what a nice example there of a tight end doing exactly what he needs to do. How about how he worked his way to the outside, made sure he secured the catch, and then anything after that, we count that as a bonus, and indeed, he gets enough for the first down. Being chased out left, his throw incomplete. DJ Chark, the intended target, and that'll bring up second down. Play action, now it's Mahomes. On the check down, he finds Kamara. It'll go as a loss of a yard, so now they deal with third and 11. Well, sometimes despite the best planning, the defense actually has a plan as well, and they blanketed everyone on that play. They were able to close it down and spill him for a loss. Again, they'll throw with Mahomes. And that incomplete nearly intercepted. And remember, he had his hands on one earlier, had one pick. Could have been his second, but instead, it's fourth down. Now, let's see. Yeah, the offense still out there. They elect to go on fourth and 11. They'll go for it. It's Mahomes. And brought down, but not before they're inside the 25. Fourth down, no problem. Just a ho-hum pickup of 14 to keep the offense on the field. Coming up to the line, and they will need to run another play here before the two-minute warning.
Now a first down carry. It's Camaro. And he'll get two or three out of that one as that is going to take us to the two-minute warning. The last run got three. Now here's second and seven. Looking to throw is Mahomes. Throw over the middle caught by the tight end, Gray. Touchdown! Noah Gray, a 20-yard touchdown. As his guys are first out of the scoreboard here this afternoon. Bouncing back nicely from that bad opening drive where he threw the interception. Drive number two leads him right down the field and into the end zone. So obviously his confidence was never lost, and that's a good thing to see. Great quality to have, and you absolutely must maintain that as a quarterback. But I have to think that they're probably still on the script that they prepared for this game. Just the second drive, they've worked on these plays all week in practice. Put them, in, put them to good use on that one. And he takes this near the 25, just a little pass there, call it the 26. KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. They had the interception last time. It led to the opening touchdown. So now 7-0 the score as they start first and 10. And yeah, this will be a gain of five as he gets it to the 30. Shaquille Barrett in on the tackle. They'd love to just strike back with a touchdown right here. And if it's a long play, so be it. But the main goal, get a couple of first downs. Run some plays, run some clock. Oh, he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. Picked off by the Pro Bowl safety Cam Chancellor. And they will finally bring this run back to an end, but not before he's down inside the five-yard line at the four. He had his eyes on the end zone. He got close. At least he set the offense up nicely, but he's probably mad he didn't take that one to pay dirt. I agree with you, and you know he's going to get teased because he didn't get it all the way into the end zone. And he is in for the score. Touchdown, New Orleans. Alvin Kamara taking it in from four yards out. And the Saints are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. Extra point by Blankenship is up and good. And that'll make the score 14 to zip. The ball upright on the tee, and the Saints kick team booms it away. Tyreek Hill set to return it. And a good return, able to get out across the 35 to the 36. The Chiefs offense about set to begin this drive. To this point, the results have not been good. Two possessions, two turnovers. And that's obviously something that can't continue, but to go a little bit deeper on that one, I would think about some play calls now, not even necessarily to my best player, but to someone I can trust with the ball, try and get things settled down a little bit. It'll go as an impressive 31-yard gain. And that might be exactly what they needed to wake up this home crowd. They haven't given them much to cheer for so far, and never underestimate the effect the home crowd with you can have on a game. So the big play changes the complexion of things. Here's first and 10, just outside the 30. Now here's Mahomes. This is caught. And all the way in for a Kansas City touchdown. Tyreek Hill, 33 yards. And the Chiefs get a late score here in the final minute of the first half. Extra point by Butker is on target. And yeah, that'll cut the lead down to a touchdown. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. Taken at the 15, a short kick. And he'll be out of bounds across the 25. The Saints offense on the field, ready to get their drive started. And with a 14-7 lead, they might just be happy to take this thing on into the tunnel. And they get him down, but not 
before he takes it across the 40-yard line. The Saints going to call the first of their timeouts as they'll stop the clock with 26 seconds to go until halftime. On play action, it's Mahomes. He'll buy some time right. Looking sideline, incomplete. Hayden Hurst, former first-round pick, the intended target. But it's going to be second down. As soon as I saw him break contain and get outside, my first thought and my eyes gravitated downfield because nowadays, most of these quarterbacks, when they do that, they want the big play downfield. They don't want to throw it short. In this case, he took the shot. It fell incomplete. To throw on second and 10, Mahomes. A throw for Boyd, but it's intercepted. Picked off by the Honey Badger, Tyron Matthew. And a potential turning point as he'll get the football in very good field position late in this first half. So after the INT, here's Mahomes. And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. Now a timeout taken. Perhaps a chance for one more quick play and then another timeout if they hurry. We'll see. So from inside the 20, here's first and 10 at the 18. To throw, it's Mahomes. And that is caught. Touchdown, Kansas City. Travis Kelsey in the final seconds of the first half. And the Chiefs have a chance to tie the game here in the final seconds of the half. Extra point by Butker is on target, and we are tied here in the second quarter. This one tied at 14 now as he sends this one away. And that drives coaches insane, doesn't it? When they see that happen, it just, it just doesn't feel right, does it? Plus, you're giving up yardage. Good starting field position for them here as they come up first and 10 at the 40. Final shot before the half for Mahomes. And they'll get to him after a gain of seven to the 47. Time for a break. We've hit halftime. Two quarters down. Two still remain. We step aside. This is the NFL on EA Sports. for the second half. It was an even first half, all tied on the scoreboard. Here's the dangerous Tyreek Hill. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here right at the 30-yard line. The KC offense out of the huddle, ready for their next drive. It's a tie football game here. What do you think, Charles, the message was at halftime? Well, I think that they probably just looked at things and said, we're fortunate that this is a tie game. No need to panic. No need to change a whole lot. We didn't play anything close to our best in the first half, so we don't have to go out and win one for the Gipper. Let's just go out and play our best football and win one for us. Here's second and nine, just a yard on that last run. They'll run it again with Barkley. And just not a big enough hole to break this one. He gets it to the 35 after showcasing that tough running of his. 
It's a four-yard pickup there, and it leaves him with third and five. Throwing now is Mahomes. And brought down, but not before reaching the 45-yard line. It'll go as a gain of 10 on a Kansas City first down. Caught that look from you there, partner. I think we're on the same page on that one. Just his first catch. I think we both thought he'd be a little more active in the passing game. Let's see if that's the start of them trying to get the ball to him a little bit more here in the second half. A first down and more for Edwards Alaire. And finally down at the 32-yard line. 23 yards on the pickup there and a first. Boy, the offensive line there, that was a thing of beauty to watch them block. I love how you give a little appreciation for those big guys up front and well-deserved. But how about the execution behind them? You can see the hours of practice that have gone into it. Great pocket by the running back. Quarterback puts it right in the perfect spot. Great mesh point by them. The timing on point. The run even better. And he is out of bounds inside the 30. He'll wind up getting right about four there on the scramble, and it's second down. Okay, he's not going to get the first down, but this is still a nice job of buying some time and then running to get to the sideline and get out of bounds and avoid the big hit. On second down, here's Barkley. And he spins away. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. An 11-yard pickup, and it's enough for a Chiefs first down. Those are the type of runs that we did not see from him in the first half, but a good start to the third quarter. And I know what everyone's thinking that's watching this. They did a great job adjusting at the half. Oftentimes, you don't make adjustments. You just dial into your game plan a little bit better, and maybe they're starting to make some headway. That is caught inside the five. And all the way to the two-yard line there before crossing over out of bounds. He was held without a catch in the first half, but he's got one here, and he also picks up a first down. They'll run. Here's Burton, the fullback. And he gets halfway there down to the one-yard line. Only a yard that time, second and goal. Mahomes now to throw. And that is caught for the touchdown, Kansas City. Mike Burton there to make the grab. And the Chiefs have taken the lead. Extra point by Butker is on target. And the lead is now 21-14. the touchdown. Here's Butker on to kick it away. Fields this way up at the 17. The Saints offense on the field ready to get their drive started. And this game was all square at halftime, but now they find themselves down seven following the opening drive touchdown here in the third quarter. And they need to take a good, relaxing, deep breath, don't you think? Because right now they might start to feel like they've got to play catch up here and start matching them point for point. But it's still too early to get there. They can still run their offense. Plenty of time to get back in this game. And that is going to do it for this third quarter of action. You are watching Madden Ultimate Team on EA Sports. Second and nine. They'll set up to throw. And this head straight to the sideline. I don't think they're going to let him get away with that. Nope, they won't. Here comes the flag. In the pocket, chucked it away, flag comes down. So you got to move a little bit, right? Know where you are on the field, have some awareness. Tackle to tackle. You got to get outside of that tackle box in order to get that done. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Out of the backfield, that's complete to Kamara. And he's going to get this to the 31, but that is still well short of what he needed. Now Mahomes got to have this one. 
And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. A big pickup there, 20 yards as they convert on fourth. Tell you what, he's been able to put the ball in some tight spots all game long. That throw, no different. Yeah, a lot of people would call it a gutsy type of a throw. I think he looks at it as, I can do it. So it's not that big of a deal to me, and I'm going to keep firing. Two yards on the carry there. It'll be second down. And the trend continues here in the fourth like it was in the first, second, and third. He's had nowhere to run. And you're probably thinking to yourself, why do they keep feeding him the football? Well, they trust him first and foremost. They do believe that over time he might actually pop one of these runs. But bottom line is he takes care of the ball well for them, so they'll keep handing it to him. That one, a first down pickup of eight. They'll look to throw. And oh, a crusher there as it's intercepted. It's the Honey Badger, Tyron Matthew. 